Jerome Sherrar from uh, GPS Dome and uh, we are about to set off uh, with a first experiment of uh, protecting a uh, GPS connected vehicle from uh, jamming a dynamic test we're going to use two cars this car will be the navigating car connected to the GPS and a second car which will be the jamming car which will follow us during the test to jam our signal using a uh, simple jammer that's bought online and uh, we're going to do two tests one with a regular navigation system unprotected and a second one with uh, our GPS dome protecting the navigation system. The two antennas we are using, as you can see, they are more than 10 centimeters away from each other. And the cables are going inside. So let's go inside. The two antennas cables are connected to the GPS dome. The GPS dome in turn is going through a bias T to the, G to the receiver and the bias T is fed from a 12 volt battery. The receiver is connected to the laptop in front. Before we set off, we can see here, this is the use center. We can see GPS reception is very, very good. We can see that we have a fixed location. And on Google Earth, we can see that our position is well known. And now we can start testing. So you can see that we're detecting motion, we have a steady signal. And we're navigating successfully and accurately. We are on the car with a jammer. Here is a jammer, and we will turn on the jammer when uh, we will start the testing. Okay, so as you can see, we're navigating successfully following our GPS or GNSS location. And after the next ride over here, what we will do is we will activate the jammer from the jamming car, which is behind us. Ehud, can you start the jamming? Okay, I'm starting the jamming. Here. Okay, so we immediately we can see a drop in the signal strength in the carrier to noise ratio, the C to N. The accuracy is not as good as it was before and now we can see that we completely lost the signal. We can see over here also the indication that we have no lock and it's very clear that the position is simply not moving. We lost reception of the, of the GPS. GPS dome without the jammer, jammer is not active. As you can see over here, we have very good reception and we can see ourselves navigating on the map. Please show the reception again. This is the reception over here and we can see that we have a locked signal. We have UTC, we have accurate time. Everything is very, very nice and normal. Hey, can you start the jammer, please? Okay. Yes, we have turned on the jammer. So the jamming car is now jamming the signal and as we can see, we're not losing reception. We have lost signal strength a little bit by about 10 dBs, but we can see that we are maintaining GPS lock and we're maintaining our position very successfully. So at all times, we're not losing lock of the signal and that is exactly what GPS dome is supposed to do.